Hey guys, in the fast lane here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to drain the built up condensation that gets stuck in these air compressors. Usually what you'll have on an air compressor is a filter before the line that goes to the air tool. Now, the reason for that is the tanks, the piston gets hot and the tank kind of stays cold and what happens is after time it creates condensation and it sits at the bottom of the tank and then with the high pressure it tends to blow it to the line it gets in your air tools and it rusts them out. The drain plug is located on the bottom of the air compressor it's usually on all of them I haven't seen one that's been in a different spot so all you need to do is throw any kind of pan underneath the compressor and if you look down under here right there that's the drain plug now you're gonna twist that lefty loosey righty tighty so I'm gonna stick my little channel locks because sometimes you got to get them in there crack it loose and then you can just twist it with your finger here and it should start spraying out pretty good you want to drain all the air out of the compressor first or else it'll shoot out like a rocket so you'll get quite a bit in here when it's all done draining you're just gonna righty tighty and it'll look like it's coming down but that's okay that's what it's supposed to do to, to seal up in the tank so you go give it a nice little tighten hitting the rest with the crescent wrench just get it a little extra tight so you don't lose any compressed air in the tank and then you're pretty much good to go now you can Go ahead and turn the switch on and fill it up. Now if you're wondering how much water builds up, this is about six months worth of water. So that, that's quite a bit of water. 